Hello everyone and welcome back to episode 35 of the Goalkeeper Career Mode. It seems to be flying through at the moment and I just want to say a big thank you obviously for all of the support and 16,000 subscribers now. I really do appreciate it. So a massive, massive thank you. We are starting today's episode against Roma. We are away. They are currently 10th, so they're mid-table. But we are currently first position as it stands. If Napoli uh, win their game and we win this, then they will, uh, and we lose this, sorry, then they will come up to the same points. But as it stands... Juventus played one game more and three points behind us. Napoli are on the same games played. But we're in a very, very nice position. This is the team for the game against Roma. Let's get into it. Roma, they could be tricky. They'll definitely have a few decent players. So they'll get some chances. We've got to be on our game. And also I want to just say while I've got the chance please go and check out my Twitch link is down in the description we are going to have live streams very soon we've got a we are due um, oh hang on Liao Chuck Weze oh Rui Patricio comes out quick uh, we are due to stream a goalkeeper career mode episode or two pretty shortly and also I am looking to stream some TSG Athletic if we actually look at the Roma side here, they have Rui Patricio, Cumbella, Indica, Mancini, Douglas Luiz, Karsdorp, Pellegrini, Aowa, Griffo, Nunez, Griezmann, Canate, Thilman, Vina, Belotti, Royce, Selic and Mendy. So they actually have a very decent side on paper, so they're definitely underachieving as it stands this season to be down in 10th position Liao Chuck Weze Liao sets it Scott oh he's put it wide should be scoring that look here it is again through the defender's legs and wide of the post 0-0 Griezmann puts it through Darwin Nunez shoots and we save and he just boots it away wow Best chance of the game so far coming for Nunez. Douglas Luiz. Darwin Nunez straight at us. Easily saved. Pellegrini. Oh, Griezmann, terrible shot. I can see why they're in 10th if they keep shooting the way they are. I don't want to jinx it. But that was a terrible effort. And it's 0-0 going into half-time. Roma, like I said, it would be a difficult game. They've got a decent squad. And they've probably been the better team so far. Just haven't taken any of their chances. Nunez. Still going. Shoots. And it was powerful but straight at us. Darwin Nunez. He's away. Shoots. Down low. And we make the stop. We're on an 8.1 match rating. We've done really well. But it just shows Roma are getting a lot of chances. Nice. Ramos. Liao. Can we nick a goal? No, Rui Patricio makes the save. Wow. That was a real good effort and a real good save. We didn't deserve to go 1-0 up, but we almost did. Robertson shoots and Robertson scores. Andrew Robertson from left back found himself in the box, found a bit of space. And he scored a really nice... Look at this. Really nice goal here. Wow, the strikers can't score this game, but... Andrew Robertson can. There we go. 77th minute. We're 1-0 up. Can we hold out for 13 minutes? This will be a good win. Because Roma have been tricky opposition. Great ball. Liao's through. Seal the game. He has 2-0. 83rd minute. That was a good one too. With Ramos. And Liao was through. Sets it back there. Gets it. Returned. And that is real nice. Well, wow. they've kept our team quiet most of the game, but these last 10 minutes, we've gone ahead. Karsdorp, set, set. Nunez, oh, he's put it away. And I just said, I think we're going to get the three points, and I might have spoke too soon. There's still a couple of minutes to go, plus added time. Nunez makes it so that we don't get a clean sheet here. 
hits it first time with power past us. Full time then. Although we don't get the clue sheet, we get the three points, which is the main thing. Away to Roma. That was a tricky game. It was an entertaining game. But we come away with the result. Two wins, two draws. No losses is our Champions League record as it stands, which gives us eight points. Leon only two points behind us. And then three points behind us is Real Madrid. So this group is still all to play for. We have Real Madrid today and then we have to play Club Bruges as well. If we lose to Real Madrid, then that brings them up to eight points. If Leon beat Bruges, then that brings them up to nine points. So it will be a bit of a scrap for the top two. But if we can draw or win today at the Bernabeu, then we are in a very good position. Right, come on boys, this is a massive, massive game. One of the biggest of the season. Let's get into it. Come on, boys. It's been snowing in Madrid. But the game has been called on. Wow, under the lights, under the snow. Or on top of the snow, should I say. This is going to be a good game. Trent, Alexander-Arnold, early doors. Trent. Shoots and it's blocked to Robertson, his former teammate clears. Ramos, great ball. Liao, yes, no. Oh. When that ball got through, I was almost already celebrating, thinking that Liao wasn't going to miss from 12 yards out. But he smashed it straight at Courtois, who makes the save. Scott, Taylor, Zafiris. Oh, and again, Courtois makes a brilliant save. And Bellingham comes away with it. Immobile puts, who's this? Vlahovic through. Who takes it a bit wider than probably expected. And thankfully, we will grasp uh, and pick that one up. Immobile. Vlahovic shoots and we push it away for a corner. Good save. Look at Ancelotti. Vlahovic. Valverde. Oh. Again, we get called into action. Decent stop. Modric. Ball over the top. Dangerous from Madrid. Valverde. Valverde. Shoots near post. And again, we have done that a couple times this goalkeeper career mode. I expect the shot. I move. And he takes that extra touch or two. And then gets in that near post. That's a silly mistake from me. Yes. Just expected him to shoot that little bit earlier. I thought he'd taken it too wide and he still gets it in the near post. Valverde scores in the 42nd minute. And we have a game on our hands here. Chuck Weze. Let's create something. Good ball. Ramos. Scott to level it. And he scores just before half time. We make it 1 0. And this is a cracking match. Right, big second half needed. It's 1 all. Like I said, a draw or a win here would be perfect. And that's a great finish. Courtois, you can't save that one. Bellingham puts it forward. Vlahovic. Oh, we just get there and make the stop. And it goes away for a corner. That was a big save. Got off our line quick there. Great ball, Salamakas. Ramos. Great bit of skill. Oh, and he finishes it. He beats the defender. Ten minutes to go. We are 1-0 up. And that was really well done. Salamak has put a great ball forward. And Ramos still had a bit to do. Cuts inside. Sends Militao the wrong way. And just finishes it nicely. Ten minutes to go. We are getting subbed off. Because we conceded that silly goal. 10 minutes to go. Can we hold on? We do. The game remains 2-1 to Milan. We took our chances at the end of the day. They had a couple more shots, um, but we held out for the 2-1 victory, which leaves the group like this. Us and Leon are going through. Real Madrid can't catch Leon now, so Leon's obviously done very well. Um, they drew against us twice, and I think they must have beat Real Madrid then. Um, once as well they beat Club Bruges twice and drew with Madrid either way they've got the points 
that means that even if Real Madrid win their last match against Leon, um, they'll only be on eight points. So us and them are going for, uh, through. But we need to beat Club Bruges last game of the group anyway, just to ensure that we have the top spot going through. Let's have a little check up on the player stats then as we are a fair few games into the season. Then top goal scorers in the division. Moise Keane has 14 for Juventus along with Ramos who has 14 for Milan. And Liao is in third place or technically second but I guess third if you count them two as two different spaces. He has got 12 goals and then there's a bit of a gap until, uh, to Osimhen of Napoli. And you can see the rest as the list goes on there. In terms of assists, we have the top three positions. Chuck Weze, Liao and Ramos. So our front three are all assisting each other. And then you can see the list there. And clean sheets wise, we are currently two ahead of Summer for Inter Milan. There We have seven clean sheets in 14 matches. So that's pretty good going. Match day now and we are playing against Bologna who are 8th. We have a 5 point gap at the top of the table. Let's see if we can increase that. San Siro's looking busy. Let's put in one last good performance this episode. Scott Ramos shoots near post and that is 1-0. 10 minutes gone. Good quick passing in the box there. Scott to Chuck Reze. Back to Scott into Ramos into the back of the net Fabian running through everybody there and we get fingertips on it and that'll be a corner to Bologna wow that came out of nothing Chakweze it's good feet Liao sets it Scott that's a brilliant block from their defender Liao again keeper saves it stops it being 2-0 going well Good ball in. Liao. Oh, what a finish. Great header. Great cross. And we are playing some nice stuff this game. 2-0 up against Bologna. We really are going along nicely. Look at that. Jumping on the shoulders. <laughs> Good little celebrate. Oh, I skipped the goal. But let's have a look, quick look at that because I do like the look of that goal. Here it is then. We will play it on from here. Ramos. Great ball in and Liao, bang. Good header. Ramos, good ball forward. Scott, Liao. Oh, great defending to get a block in there. And if the defence and keeper weren't so good for Bologna, we could have been 4 or 5 nil up. Taylor, Liao. Scott to Ramos to shoot again and it's blocked. Good header, Robertson. Oh, and it's headed away. God, what a chance. Robertson turns, shoots, and this time he scores. His header was saved just a couple minutes ago. And he's turned in the box and slotted it into the bottom corner. Look at this for a great turn. This is like a striker, not a left back. Andy Robertson. Good finish. Oh, no. Orsolini sets him in. Shoots. Oh, get up. But Romero clears it. Thank God for that. Good save that. That was a close range effort. Colson sets it. Shoots and what a finish. Nothing we can do. We tried flying across the goal when the ball was crossed. But he has absolutely smashed that past us. And no clean sheet for us against Bologna here. Need to hold out for the um, three points as well. They've started the second half very sharp. Look at that for a pass. And an even better finish. Ramos. Running forward. Ramos just skips past the man. Makes it four. And just when you think Bologna might be getting back into the game. They're not. It's 4-1. And I think we have the three points. This defender doesn't do much in the way of stopping him, does he? Look, he just lets him run past him. And the keeper. There's nothing he can do. Full time then a 4-1 win and we did very well. We took our chances I must admit because I don't think Bologna were quite that bad. They did have some chances and they played some nice football to be honest. They weren't a bad side but we were clinical. We done well and we walk away with the three points. Table as it stands then we have a six point gap 
at the top of the league. Juventus have only lost one game the same as us, but they have drawn a couple more than us, which we've obviously turned into wins. So that is why we are six points clear of them. And then Napoli on the same as them too. So if we start slipping up, we're going to let them both back in. So we can't afford to slip up here and let teams come back at us. And then that is the league table as we go down the league. In the relegation zone at the moment is Hellas Verona, Frosinone and Cagliari. Also, give us a comment down below if you think we should set a target team for next season or just uh, interested to know who you really want us to join. Roma want us. I don't think that will be a good move for us. Um, Arsenal and Lazio. Um, but yeah, we're currently an AC Milan player. We might even be an AC Milan player next season. We're not decided yet. But let's have a look what we got coming up. we got a game against Torino, Club Rouge, Fiorentina, and Cagliari next episode then. So please, again, thank you for the 16,000 subscribers. Please make sure you like the video. Subscribe to the channel. I've been the TSG. Goodbye.